Hello everyone, it's Mr. Andre and I'm here in the library at House by Town English. Today we have another wonderful winter story. Snowman at Night, written by Carolyn Buner and illustrated by Mark Buner. It's a great story about what snowmen do at night. If you're curious, make sure you read this story. Snowman at Night Written by Carolyn Buner, illustrated by Mark Buner, read by Mr. Andre. One wintry day, I made a snowman, very round and tall. The next day, when I saw him, he was not the same at all. His hat had slipped, his arms drooped down, he really looked a fright. It made me start to wonder, what do snowmen do at night? I think that snowmen start to slide when it gets really dark, off the lawn and down the street, right into the park. They gather in a circle while they wait for all the others, sipping cups of ice-cold cocoa made by snowmen mothers. Then the snowman games begin. They line up in their places, each one anxious for his turn in the snowman races. After everyone has had a chance at racing once or twice, they go on over to the pond to do skating tricks on ice. Sometimes they start giggling and then they act like clowns. They bump into each other till they all fall down. They gather up their snowballs. The pitcher takes his aim and underneath the moonlit sky they play a baseball game. No one knows just how it started but soon it's quite a sight. With snowmen throwing snowballs in the world's best snowball fight. Then it's time for sledding. It's a wild ride down the hill. Woohoo! They yell. This is by far the snowman's biggest thrill. Finally, they're tuckered out and getting sleepy, so they slowly gather up their things and one by one they go. So if your snowman's grin is crooked, or he's lost a little height, you'll know he's just been doing what snowmen do at night. The end. This has been a reading for House by Town English, read by Mr. Andre.